Welcome back, welcome back everybody. It's Albert LaBelle, aka Big Al. Alright, I got a challenge locking device this time around. It's simply called uh, Number 3, and it's by the one and only Jeffrey Post. And uh, I gotta tell you, Jeffrey Post, uh, he's one of those guys that came in kind of with a bang. Almost kind of, kind of reminded me of myself because uh, when I first entered the picture, I just started uh, tossing a bunch of challenge locks out there to kind of basically just to get my name up there a little bit really uh, and I think uh, Jeffrey Post kind of did the same thing he's got many uh, challenge locks floating around I've had several of them already and they're all pretty freaking fun um, like I said this one's just number three on the key tag uh, he doesn't have the key mummified so we got to look at that not uh, not a whole not a whole lot of crazy there pretty straightforward actually it almost looks like the key at my front door to be honest with you if you want to try to come over and pick it <laughs> but uh let's see lock does work fine i have not tried this one yet by the way but uh let's uh get into it together what do you say um let's see where's the uh listen here we go another tension wrench uh there's a quick set so should be able to go top of the keyway and they've got that ledge right there too on these quick sets which make it pretty darn handy to pick them uh, I don't know what pick I'll use maybe how about uh, let's try the south ord I, I re recently finally got some of that uh, heat shrink and I put um, on these south ord because they just had the metal handles I actually ended up putting three layers of that shrink wrap on these suckers to get it nice and good I don't know if you can tell but anyways works out good a little bit better than the uh, uh, steel of the handle. All right, so let's go. I guess we'll go counterclockwise or <laughs> clockwise rather, and see if we can't get something going here. We got on the camera. Yeah, we're good. All right. Let's see, you get a feel for it. Bouncy up front. Feels like maybe four-ish. Oh, that didn't really feel like a click. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. Not really clicking. Okay, there we go. That was a nice click. I think that was two. One. turn there off of five I think four three two maybe I've got something overset already two three four yeah I'm not really feeling any clicks like nothing feels like it's setting to be honest with you let me uh ixnay that pick and i'll go with the uh the uh, peterson gem there we go i didn't really feel anything with that one four yeah see that's that's gnarly five okay got a baby turn off of that one Coming back out. Counter rotation, I think there it was two. Huh. Tricky little sucker, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five. Let's see if I can get something to talk to me here. Three. Two, 
four. If I can get under a five. Nice, Jeffrey. Tricky little sucker. Finally, I think I hear thunder out there. We're supposed to get like uh, three or four days in a row of some thunderstorms. Man, I'll tell you what, I am not. I am not doing well here. <laughs> Five, four, three. I'm not sure what I'm doing here. One, two, three, four. I've got something overset, I think. turn finally. One, three, four. I'm not feeling them actually uh, click, so there's some nastiness in here, I can promise you that much. There we go. Pin one. Something's funky I think in pin one. Let's find out together, huh? All right, very good, uh, Jeffrey. Very, very freaking cool. That was fun. Um, get back down here. Yeah, there's some funky in here. Promise you that much. <laughs> let's see what kind of funky. All right, let's bring the camera down over here. And using the pink stuff still for uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Uh, where we at? That'll work. All right. So, let's see, I'll leave it open. Yep, so I did. Still open. Uh, we got a key, so I'll lock it back up. And, ooh, it's got one of them tough clips. I bought some of those recently. Finally found them online somewhere. They're good clips. Yep, same ones I got. They're very good. All right, bada boom, bada bing. Uh, Get the key. It's got a nice smooth back end on it, but since it is a challenge lock, I will still try to shim it. Alright. Let's see what we got in this beast of burden here. Five pinner. All needed to picking. Oh yeah, it's got some work. Got some work done here. Flip these around. All right, get some specs on. And take a peeky peek at the core. Uh, what we got here? We've got, oh, threading and everything. Threading in all five. All right, let's uh, get that shim out of there and go upstairs. See what Jeffrey's got for us here. Where are we at? Right there. Oh, yeah. Got some work. Number one. Number two. Looks like a spooly serrated combobulation. Number three. 
steel spring. Two, wow. Uh, almost looks upside down, but maybe, uh, well, I guess it could work both ways. We'll get a close up on these. That's the way it was in there, so that's the way I'm putting it down there. And we got a standard in four. And number five, standard. Alrighty, and take a peek upstairs. Oh, I do feel something there. Okay, so let's go. One is threaded. Three is threaded. Okay, it feels like one and three, if I got it right. Upstairs, one and three are threaded. You can see one. Alright, well played. Well played, sir. Scoot those up. Bring the camera down and check out some penny pins, huh? Again, that was number three from Jeffrey Post. Jeffrey, thank you so much for pinning this bad boy up. Highly appreciate it. I will get it out to the community uh, sooner, uh, soon enough. Okay, let's see what we got here. If I can hold it steady. Um, key pins. We've got, I'd almost call that a spool, really. Uh, or a very, very wide serration. Uh, like I said, almost same thing here. Double spooled, we can call that. Uh, this one here, now I don't think that part right here will come into play whatsoever. Um, but this part up here is, will act, um, I think it would act like a spool, really. Um, if you accidentally go up too far with this one by picking, you can get it stuck right here. Um, four, definitely a spool. Five, again, very wide serration or spool like and drivers there we go double spool or two wide serrations number two is a spool with a I'll be damned it's got a little ring and ring on it that's kind of flopping around maybe just some leftover metal uh, three spool four standard five standard and all the springs are they look steel. They're silver anyway. Alright, there we go. That'll do her. Number three from Jeffrey Post. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up, please. And uh, comment, all that good stuff. I highly appreciate it. Alright, Big Al, signing out.